live at Exotica after hours. Victor Salazar here with the lovely, gorgeous, and fucking amazing Penny Packs. Wow. Penny. It is. Tell us about Exotica. How's Exotica been treating you? Well, it is actually my very first ever Exotica experience, so I'm just taking it all in. It's a whole new crowd of people that I've never met before, a whole bunch of hot ladies I've never seen before either, so I don't know. It's really overwhelming, actually, but fun, because it's nice to meet everybody from over here on the East Coast, you know? So 30,000 people are expected to be here this weekend. What does that say about the industry and where it's at right now? Uh, I don't know. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I think that's good. I think that's the most that's that's that they've lot. ever had at, at the New Jersey Exotica. Oh, wow. Gosh, then, I mean, ye yeehaw. That's great. <laughs> I'm glad that the industry is booming. So so for the fans out there that, that don't know you very well, well how would you get into the industry? Well, long story short, I was just bored. And uh, I grew up doing like theater and dancing and acting and doing all that kind of stuff. So I love performing. Uh, already and uh, a guy hit me up on a modeling website because I was you know trying to be an actress and uh, I was like have you ever thought about doing erotic modeling and one thing led to another it was a porn shoot for reality kings and uh, I did it it was actually really fun and like super just like empowering and liberating and I felt like just at home you know I felt like you know like I was at like my theater camp like with all my other theater nerds and uh, with all my fellow perverts finally and that was pretty much it after that I moved to LA and now I'm here six years later how's the industry changed since you've been in six years deep hmm well I would say there's definitely a lot more uh, free porn that we have to kind of like find our way around which can be a little bit difficult but it's also working out to our favor you know as far as like advertising and promotion and stuff like that um, and there's just a whole there's a huge like um, a lot more people doing cam shows doing live cam shows which is something that I personally do on my website pennypackslive.com uh, every week I hang out for an hour with all of my members and uh, just get to know everybody because I think everyone nowadays is just craving that like live experience and uh, I do too. Yeah, yeah. And in regards to social media, how, how has that played a role in your career? Uh, well, first of all, I hate it <laughs> because I did not know that was a part of the job. I thought I'd basically just show up to set and have awesome sex and go home. But there's a whole other world to porn now where you interact uh, with fans, which is about the only part I like about it because um, I get to get a lot of feedback from them. They give me ideas, stuff they want to see, stuff they don't want to see. <laughs> Sometimes it's feedback I don't care for, but you know, in the end, uh, I can appreciate a critique and criticism. So I, I, I appreciate social media. I just wish it didn't take up so much of my time. Now you already name dropped your website. Where else can we find you? Oh, everywhere. Gosh, I shoot for um, everyone, all the websites. <laughs> there you have it with the lovely Penny Packs live from Exotica.